Hello, 4-Bit users. Welcome to the last video, which is part of the Euro 2024 series. This Sunday is the Euro 2024 final. Spain and England will face each other at Olympia Stadion Berlin. The game will be crucial for both teams' histories. Spain, alongside Germany, are the teams with the most Euro trophies. England, on the other hand, has never triumphed in the Euros and will want to make their country happy and proud. In the last Euro held in 2021, England reached the final. In regular time, they drew 1-1 against Italy, and penalties were needed to determine the champion. England lost the penalties 3-2, and Italy triumphed. This was the only Euro final England has played in their history. Spain, on the other hand, has played four finals, winning three of them in 2012, 2008, and 1964. Let's look back at the tournament and see both teams' road to the final. Spain finished first in Group B, recording three straight wins. They defeated Croatia, Italy, and Albania to gain nine points. Spain was the only team to achieve a 100% win rate in the group stage of the tournament. In the round of 16, Spain defeated Georgia 4-1, and then in the quarterfinals, they drew 1-1 in regular time against Germany. In extra time, Mikel Marino scored to send his home country to the semi-finals. In the semis, Spain defeated France 2-1. Randall Colomwani scored with a header after a Mbappe cross. After that, Spanish wonder kid Lamine Yamal scored a beautiful goal to make it 1-1. In the 25th minute, Danny Olmo scored to make it 2-1 for Spain. England finished in first place in Group C. They recorded five points with a win over Serbia and two draws against Denmark and Slovenia. In late-night drama and extra time, England defeated Slovakia in the round of 16. In the quarterfinals, they drew again in regular time against Switzerland. Penalties were needed to send England to Euro 2024's semi-finals. In the semis, England turned over the result against the Netherlands. Xavi Simons opened the score with a beautiful goal. After that, Harry Kane scored a penalty. Ollie Watkins, who came off the bench, scored and sent his country to the final. Spain and England have met each other two times in official meetings in modern history. Both games were in 2018, part of the Nations League. Spain won one and England won one. We should note that both games ended with over 2.5 goals and both teams finding the back of the net. Looking at the stats, Spain has scored 12 goals, while England has scored half of them, six goals. In the total 12 games that both teams played, eight of them ended with under 2.5 goals. In the trend section, we will only note that Spain is unbeaten at halftime in their last 14 all-competition games. Another trend says that England is unbeaten in all of their last 14 matches in all competitions. If you want to get deeper insights about more statistics and player information, you can check our preview for this encounter. In conclusion, based on recent games and overall stats, Forabet predicts a low-scoring draw at Olympia Stadion Berlin with extra time and or penalties needed to determine the new European champion. How do you think the match will end? Do you agree with Forabet's prediction? You can write down in the comments.